Inner Solar Europe is at the center of a dynamic European PV market and is the international place to be when it comes to solar and everything that happens around it. Here you can see all the innovations that drive the market. So, welcome to Inner Solar Europe 2022. Actually, there's two main reasons for, for, for solar to, to, on, to be on the rise. Number one is a very positive one. We are getting so cheap that we can kick out oil and gas literally anywhere in the world. And the second thing is a bit more of a negative reason. We have conflicts about oil. We have the Ukraine crisis. We see that we have to get rid of oil and gas. And that's the second reason. We just launched our global market outlook. What we are, are showing in this report is that we added some 168 gigawatt of solar globally last year, an all-time high. And if you look at the forecasts, they also look very bright. You know that we've crossed the one terawatt benchmark basically just a couple of weeks ago globally. So one terawatt installed some flabbergasting 1,000 gigawatt of solar globally. And we will reach, in only three and a half years, we will reach two terawatt. So a development which is incredibly fast, but that should not hide that we need to go much faster if we want to reach the climate targets we need to reach. Here at Intersolar Europe, it's the sheer size of the fair and the different subjects it touches. So we see the new business models, uh, we see everything is converging a, a little bit and moving together. We see little innovations like in-frame inverters in modules. The large inverters are now running the software for the energy management. We see actual application of agricultural PV and uh, a lot of floating uh, PV that is actually happening and being deployed out there. We see hydrogen move in, big industrial players moving into the world of electrolyzer and creating green hydrogen and that is very exciting and there's a lot to see here. 